fucking sleeping. <laughs> I'm in this huge Brett's house. Hello. Welcome back to another Brett's episode of Retro 70s Kids. Now, I didn't mean to do so many in a row, but I had to. On Saturday, I got a photo text from my good friend and subscriber, Marilyn, from Scrappy Fish, with some incredible photos of this beautiful Brett's mansion. And, oh, of course, I had to do a show on it. So she very kindly has brought it in, and I've set it up, and she actually got it at a invitation-only car boot, at garage sale. And she paid $80 for this, with pretty much everything it came with, which wasn't much, I'll talk about that in a minute, and 10 Bratz dolls. So for $80 for all that, and plus some other clothes and accessories. That was a pretty good deal. So um, I'm going to show you that now. Oh, and Marilyn and Trevor are joining us in the audience. Hello, Marilyn and Trev. Thank hello. you for coming. Hi there. And Sally. Oh, hello. This is the audience we needed on my big 30th. Oh, yeah. But anyway, that's <laughs> okay. So, let's get to it. This is, as I said, look at this, another incredible, another incredible piece of architectural design by MGA. It is from 2006. It is, there were three different releases. There was the Bratz uh, Passion for Fashion House. Then there was the Bratz, um, Bratz, uh, Bratz World Mansion. And then there was the Bratz Movie Mansion, and they all had different colorings. But I think this is either the first or the second one, but it's one of the earlier ones anyway. But I have added more to it, but let's just have a look at the design. Look at this. This is like a, a Californian Spanish, and we're going to pop up a couple of photos to show you what I mean. Very popular. If you do a tour of the Stars Homes in Hollywood, and you go up the Hollywood Hills, you'll see a lot of this sort of style. And they haven't held back from the tiled roof to the little points of detail on the wrought iron, the windows with more tile on these windows down here. There's a little number and that says Bratz there in the corner. The door opens up with beautiful balcony. And there's some sort of little symbol here. It's like Chloe's symbol, but I'm, I'm not sure. Do you know what that symbol is, Marilyn? No, I don't. No? I think there's one symbol there that represents Bratz. I think that's down there. Okay. And then the beautiful palm tree that came with it. And going around to the side. More in beautiful detail. See, I, thought, I was impressed by the Bratz Skywise pad, which I have. But uh, this, this also blows me away. And this is a juice bar slash um, music booth. What are they called? Um, DJ, DJ. DJ booths. And um, the only thing missing from this set is the little tiny surface barbecue that you turn it over and it turns into a DJ mixing music station thing. And that can also go inside. But just so I could fit it on the platform to rotate. It's a bit squished up. We'll go around. Now, of course, I have added a lot of things to this because it was quite plain. It didn't come with very much at all. It originally came with, of course, the house, this chase lounge, which uh, there's also a plastic, uh, like sausage cushion that went with it, um, the stairs and the dance platform, which is amazing and works. As you can see, it's flashing there. Now this also plugs into your phone and you can play music through it. But uh, it don't, we could try it out, but I'm not because a bit of copyright music. So we're just gonna tell you that it does work. So, and that's all the stuff that, oh, and the juice bar, that's all that came with it. So they really could have given some sort of more furniture. And I thought the detail on the inside was a little drab. Um, it's great to display still. Like if I had it, I would display it mainly from the outside, but um, when you see the detail they've done on the, one of their previous homes, which is the one-storey fold-out house, the detail in that was incredible. So I just thought they may have stepped it up a bit. If they went to the trouble of doing the outside like they did, they could have done the inside. Do you agree, audience? Yes, yes. I do. Right. Good. Now, some of the furniture I have... Oh, and some of the girls... I did a swap trade purchase thing with Marilyn. She had the very first release, original first four girls. 
the um, Yasmin, Chloe, Jade, and Yasmin, Chloe, Jade, Sasha. Sasha. <laughs> See, that's, I usually can't remember their names. And so uh, I've got now got the very first release ever of Bratz from 2001, and I also got two of the Stratic Girls um, from 2002. So they're scattered about, and just some 2002 boys that are around. So. As I said, this is the lounge that comes with it. I've added the cushions and the phone, of course. But it's beautiful, beautiful lounge. They could have, they could have had another piece with that. This is from the high-rise pad. And the lights, the only problem with this, the lights didn't work and Trev did everything he could to try and fix it. So he's improvised and put these beautiful yeah, lights, right. which I think even work better than the one under the, in the entranceway there. So he's done an awesome job there, lights it up beautifully. And over here in this corner, oh. oh, this is a Mycene chair. This is the uh, the guitar corner because this second level you can't do a lot with. You know, they if you're going to go to this much trouble to make this sort of beautiful toy structure, give it another four inches. Like, <laughs> yeah. so there's not a lot you can do to do here. Mainly display, and um, then we've got the dance floor here. This is the dining room suite that I had in the high-rise pad that I've shown in a few episodes ago. Go and have a look, it's a great episode. Um, this is from the high-rise pad. Hello. This lounge is from the Bratz Fold Out House I was talking about. And I've added the cushions, of course. And this is a little, quite, reading corner. And this um, settee and footrest is from the Internet Cafe, Bratz Internet Cafe. So it's borrowed from that. And these are just some random pieces. Let's have a look at the girls at the... We've got the first release Chloe in her outfit. Jade. Yeah, that's Jade. These are the tags I need to put on so I can identify them because I forget. And this is the juice bar set up. These strings didn't come with it, but I've, I've added them. I've just random ones I've picked up. And is that Sasha? That's Yasmin. She's got pretty hair. She has. Look at this funky dude. Oh, wow. Yeah. Look at the dreadies on that. I have tried to look him up and I can't find him anywhere, so I don't know what he is. Oh, who he is. Yeah. But he just looks good behind the bar. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Jamaica. He does. Jamaica. Marshall. Yeah. What else? Have I mentioned everything? Let me just refer to my notes. Oh, yeah. These on eBay, if you want to buy it new, go from about three eighty five up to over a thousand dollars. So that's how much you'll pay on eBay for this thing, and um, you can get them cheaper, of course, from your local sellers. But uh, you'll you'll pay under a hundred dollars usually. Like Marilyn got a really good deal. So, but usually if you pay under a hundred dollars, it's really in bad condition. Is that postage included? Oh no, postage on top of that. Like sometimes three hundred dollars, like it's ridiculous because it's all from the states. Because it's yeah. So yeah. Another rotation. Also, while I'm just having a quiet moment doing the rotating. My last episode, I wished my mother a happy birthday. Hi, Mum. And I knew I'd get her age wrong, and I did, and I did get into trouble for it. Naughty. <laughs> the next day, I got a text from Dad just saying, your mother said she's blanking 81, oh, not God. 83. <laughs> oh, you, and you went over. Oh, God. Yeah. yeah, I was in trouble. Big time. <laughs> Any questions? Know. The trees, the plants. Little. The beautiful palm tree came with it. That's right. And these little ones. The little, uh, I've added them. You've added them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those little, uh, like, toperies. Toperies. I, I got it at a car boot. Okay. 
Or like a bag for a dollar. Is that what you call them? Tokery. Tokery. The ones that are... Uh, hand ha cut. Yeah. Yeah. Into different shapes. And that's your cute. I don't know what that's from, but it's wire. I don't think it's Barbie. Barbie wouldn't make anything out of wire. And it would be pink. So that's it. What else have I got to say about this? It's amazing. How many adjective adjectives can I possibly use for this? It's just incredible. So thank you, Marilyn, so much for bringing it over for me to show. You made it look amazing. It fantastic. I, I would love it, it but color. I'm happy to hand it back because it's just so big. Well, yeah. it's not when it closes up. Yeah. It's really it's not right. that you oh, know. Yeah. Yeah. But, um, I love the colour, the yellow. I think this, this is one of the more realistic colours that they had. Like yeah. one of them I saw online was like a lavender and something. Oh, right, which just does And then one was more of a white or a cream, okay. which was still realistic, but, but this, is nice. this is more of what they've got out there. Nice colour. In Los Angeles. Who would want to go jogging on a fault line, I ask you. <laughs> so I think that's it. It's only a short one. My beautiful, well, not mine, it's not mine, it's Marilyn's. Yes, yes. Because everything else is mine, mine, mine. <laughs> Marilyn's beautiful 2006 Bratz Mansion from MGA. They'll never make anything like this again. Never. Yeah. Not to this detail. It does look good. I love this chair at the front too. Yeah, that little chair that I just spoke about. Yeah. Catch up. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Where's it behind? There's a guy at the door with the sunglasses as a bouncer. <laughs> yes. Yes. Well, yeah. a party mansion. It is a party mansion. So yeah, that's it. Thank you very much for joining me. Thank you again, Marilyn, Trev, and Sally. Thank you. And Bye. don't forget to like, share it, and subscribe. And don't forget to check me out on Instagram because I've leapt into the 21st century. And thank you and good night. Good night. Thank you. Well done. Well done. jogging on a fault line, I ask you. Kev, talk closer to the house. Yeah. <laughs> well, this yeah. is a party mansion. It is a party mansion. That's why I added little places for them to come down. <laughs> Shit. Sorry. So yeah, that's it. Thank you very much for joining me. Thank you again, Marilyn, Trev and Sally. Thank you. And don't forget to like, share it and subscribe and check me out on Pinterest and check me out on Pinterest and thank you and good night. Good night. And Instagram. And Instagram. Yeah. No, not Pinterest, Instagram. That's what am I talking about? Oh, there's just too many things. So <laughs> it's not Pinterest. I have Christmas Redo. on Pinterest, but just Instagram. Retro 70s. Kid. Redo it. Redo it. What did I say? Thank you very much. Wait a minute. Get it from there now. Um, thank you very much. Thank you for joining me. Um, no, I, I've completely lost it. Wait, oh, we're going <laughs> you to lost the flow. We're going to have more bloopers. Um, it's always here. <laughs> oh, it's this point. <laughs> Come on, you can do it. You can do it. I'm flushing now. I'm getting flushed. Like the zero kind of <laughs> just the right size. <laughs> Let's get the order of TV out. The catch turn of a joint. Yeah, that's right. Joint. Oh, she's too heavy. Hello, are oh, you done? I'm done. <laughs> He's probably dizzy. Say hello, Lady Penelope. You fall off here because you feel a little odd. You want some more? You want some more? She's much on some more. Do you want some more? Do you want some more?